Hello, folks, and welcome back to, I was going to say Ichiban. I mean, kind of, a little bit, but no, this is Yakuza Like a Dragon. Uh, we're going to go ahead and dive into a dungeon here. Namba needs to catch up, and Adachi needs to also catch up with his newest his newest job. If we can get Zhangji and everybody else, that'd be good too, but that's kind of a kind of side issue. The dungeon is going to be the best way to do it, not to mention um, it's going to give us some golden chests and whatnot, which is going to be great. We need some, I mean, we need a, a revenue stream. Right now we got 2.5 million, it's not bad. Uh, maybe before we go into the dungeon, we need to, yeah, maybe we should actually go to Popo and drop off our cash. It's probably not a horrible idea. Dungeon's right there, but let's go to the, let's go to the Popo first. Go to the mark over here and just make sure this is going to be set the way we want it to be. Apparently a flavor over there. We're not going to worry about that right now. Uh, ATM, please. ATM. Where's your ATM? Your team's over here. Yeah, let's go ahead and drop in the 2.5. I don't think that counts as spending game, but okay. I mean, I wouldn't... Yeah, I wouldn't count that as spending. I'm getting kind of hungry. Let's stop by a convenience store or something. Oh, I could go for some chips right about now. I, too, enjoy potato chips every so often. Yeah, I love the seaweed and salt flavor. Nah, a refined man goes just lightly salted, nothing more. You do yourself a disservice. The best flavor is consomme. <laughs> Looks like we're split. But what's your favorite flavor, Adachi-san? Actually, my uh, stomach can't really handle chips these days, so as long as it's not too many, I'll take pretty much anything. I mean, I used to be able to down a whole bag like it was nothing. It sucks. Why don't we each just get our favorite? Indeed. We should enjoy them while we still can. Hey, don't get all mopey on me. I can still eat them. Just don't overdo it. I'll make you some steamed potatoes sometime. Steamed potatoes, the most bland food in the universe. Okay, we've got... Do we actually have a lock? Hold on. Let me look at the bond here. I we just got... Um, let's look at it. That site? I'm maybe at it. Maybe it's fine. Um, yeah, okay. So we can't bond anymore with her, which makes sense. Can't bond any with you, which makes sense. You were still working on the bond. What about... Um, I think we need to switch over for that. I mean, she can't raise the bond unless we do the Ichiban holdings. Ooh, he's close. He's really close. Huh. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna switch out just to get his bond up. Then I think we need to attack some stuff around here to get his bond up to, I think 15 is gonna be the lock. We'll go to the survive bar, do his mission, then go to the dungeon. All right, so we just need some bad guys. Hey, look, some bad guys. Don't get run over. He might even be like one fight, but we'll see. Oh, he goes first, huh? Okay. Um, yeah, why not? Crescent slash. Let's see what happens. Okay, why did you use your katana for that, though? You weirdo. Um, he might have been weak to that, but that didn't seem very weak. Uh, maybe a reckless charge over there in the back. Oh, come on. Way there in the back. There we go. I don't know how good that was. Yeah, it was okay. It was okay. Okay, right up to me. That's fine. Oh, I uh, resisted one of them. It's all right. That didn't work at all well. Okay. Okay, he's just going to silence. Oh, no, you stole mana. I hate that. Hate that. Okay, Namba, you need a better guitar. I know, I know. I'm going to go ahead and do some Pyro Breath on somebody weak like this guy. Take him out. Okay, great. You go ahead and slash this guy. Yeah, I think there's this. I mean, you should really use both hands if you're using a katana, but... I mean, maybe he knows what he's doing. Up. 
Good old kick to the face. Okay, we got Bond 5, which means, yep, looks like he's actually locked. What I expected. He is locked, right? Can we tell if he's actually locked? Uh, to be party. I guess stats, maybe. Yeah, you. Yeah, okay, he's definitely, he should be locked at 15. We'll do one more fight just to make sure. We need to go back to the survive bar anyway in order to get the bond set. So let's get over here. There should be a bunch of bad guys around here somewhere. Uh, do I, I forgot what I need for you. What do I need for you? Could have been anything good lately. Let me tell you what I've got cooking. Business pros, that's too hot to handle. Okay, so he's going to give us... Actually, we could probably afford that. All right, send you a dog. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, a suspicious guy giving you a tip off the street seems like maybe that wouldn't be the best thing to follow up on, but sure. Sure. Okay, so we'll battle these guys, but I'm pretty sure Zhangji is now as far up as he's going to be. Oh, these guys won't matter at all. All right, just attack anybody. And you bonked into him a little bit there, which is kind of interesting. Yeah, just think predator attacks here, just whatever. Then follow up. Okay, sure enough, we've hit the we've hit the max. Okay, that's what I thought. Okay, well, thank goodness I know where the survive bar is. At least I think I do. It's up here, right? Yeah, okay, yeah. It's past the taxi cab. That's right. And we were just here. We were just here. They didn't plan that out right. Okay, we got three more minutes on the... Or two and a half more minutes, rather. But here we go. Bond opportunity. Let's do it. Uh, okay, there we go. I was going to say, no ice, excuse me? But no, there was the ice right there. Hello, Kasuga-san. <laughs> I must say, this place is quite comfortable. Isn't it, though? Yeah, ain't it? Also, seriously, man, how's a guy make drinking alone look so cool? Guess it's easy when you're as handsome as you. <laughs> That's kind of you to say. Why don't you let me buy you a drink? Yo, for real? <laughs> hey, now you're speaking my language, man. So, sake? You certainly are a mysterious one, Kasuga-san. Songhui speaks highly of you as well. I dare say it makes me jealous. Oh, come on. Uh, speaking of, have you been with her long? You've got this butler and lady of the house thing going on. Weird way to put it. It's okay. only been three years since I was brought into the Komijul. I can't say it's been long. No shit. Up until then, I was with a group called the Jingon Mafia. I was their leader's body double. Huh. Body double? Dangerous. You mean like a decoy? Just like the real thing? Indeed. If my master was ever targeted by our enemies, I was to be killed in his place. That was my duty. Holy shit. I didn't figure people still did that kind of stuff. Uh, wait, does that mean your face is... An imitation, yes. What you see is a result of large-scale plastic surgery. But I'll have you know my previous face was rather handsome as well. A shame not a single picture of it exists anymore. Well, security really? Purposes. Out the window then, huh? In a manner of speaking, yes. So that means Junki Han isn't your real name either, right? What's your real name then? Oh, does he trust you enough for that? <laughs> Surely we're not that close yet. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. Come on. First step in becoming friends is calling each other by name, right? Hmm. Maybe. Well, isn't this awkward? I'm afraid I'm the type to want a bit more distance with people. Yeah, don't push too much. Is that how it was with the Jingon Mafia? From the name, I'm guessing it was some sort of Korean Yakuza-like thing. Weren't you once a member of the Tojo clan, Kasuga-san? I'm surprised you've never heard of the Jingon Mafia. See, I was in the clink for a long time. The Jingon Mafia and the Tojo clan clashed in the 1980s, long before you were serving time. The 80s? Dude, that's 40 years ago. I was just a baby back then. Doubt I even had hair. 
Yes, I had yet to be born myself. Regardless, early in the decade, the Tojo clan attacked the Jingon Mafia and massacred a great number of them. Around 30 or so. 30? Back then, Kamurucho was the most sought-after territory in all of Asia. I've heard the conflicts for control were rather intense. The Tojo clan was incredibly strong, and they made sure it was a well-known fact. Still, to off 30 of them is... To get their revenge, the Jingon Mafia main arm in Korea sent even more members to Japan. Some of them as undercover agents. But deception is a tricky business, and all who could not strike at the heart of the Tojo clan were considered failures and forbidden from returning. In the end, those that couldn't carry out the mission were abandoned and left without any place to go. That would be his father? One of them happened to be my father. There we go. Then. You were born here, in Japan. Yes, but be that as it may, I don't recall being welcomed here. I wasn't even accepted by any Korean communities either. My family was treated like slime and kicked out from wherever we went. We came to be called the Stray Jingon Mafia, running away whenever we were discovered. Slimes who run away, huh? You were too much experience to be a slime. I mean, if you want to tie into your whole Dragon Quest thing, yes. She got with Maverick. There you go. There's a much better response. I like that one. Stray Jingon Mafia ain't bad, but personally, I think Maverick sounds a hell of a lot cooler. Yep. Maverick. One that's strayed from the herd. Exactly. Maverick Jingon Mafia is a bit of a mouthful, though, isn't it? It's a little much. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, I guess you're right. Stray Jingon it is. <laughs> but I will give you points for style, if nothing else. The game didn't. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, no, there we go. There it is. So, what happened to the Stray Jingon after that? Oh, well, it died. Uh, yeah, he's, he's setting himself for that one. Okay, it's fair. He doesn't want to talk hmm. about it. Oh, there we go. Enter the 21st century. The winter of 2006. Around the time I turned 20, the Jingon Mafia from the mainland made an all-out assault against the Tojo clan. Bold. But even as that happened, the stray Jingon Mafia received not a word of warning. We were left completely in the dark. Our fathers were entirely forgotten by the countrymen that sent them here. That's dumb. You don't say. I might know a guy who could sympathize with that. Oh? Yeah. He's right in front of you. <laughs> I got tossed out by my family and locked up for 18 years. Oh, <laughs> that's right. That must be why I can't bring myself to hate you, Kasuga-san. So, what happened to the Jingon's big all-out attack? Probably failed. Despite their careful planning, they were ultimately crushed by the Tojo clan. Ironically, those that survived came from all over to join those of us in the Stray Jingon Mafia. <laughs> It was a miserable sight. Both sides cut off from home and left with no choice but to band together in the social sewer of a country that wasn't theirs. Sounds like you struggled. I wouldn't know it from looking at you, though. Yeah, really I could say the same to you. Yeah, finally starting to warm up to me? It would seem so. I haven't been acting much like myself today. I had a great time drinking with you, Kasuga-san. I truly mean that. So whatever happened to the real Junki Han? What's he up to now? He revived the Jingon Mafia roughly three years ago, and at that time had taken over a considerable portion of Kamurocho. But he was shot in the head and killed. I was absent at the time. And it all came crashing down, huh? Hmm? Wait, then that means... Can't you use your real name now? Why keep up the body double thing? <sighs> You're... Uh, you're not trying to become the real Jungi Han, are you? I mean, the position's uh, open. Who can say? But that's none of your concern, is it, Kasuga-san? Or am I wrong? He's always curious, that's uh, all. Ah, you got me there. <laughs> Farewell. Guess he's not the type to open up so easily. <laughs> I'll just have to keep drinking with him. Okay, so what's the bond level we got to? 
Oh, zero. Okay, so we just barely opened the door. Okay, he's still been gaining experience with this, though. That's why I thought we still had a, I thought we had a previous bond with him, but I guess not. I mean, I guess we could leave Seiko-san out of it and keep him in the party for a little while. It's not the cannon party, but that should be okay. We just have to keep in mind that cannon-wise, she's definitely always with the party. Alright, so nobody else here to bond with. Let's go to the dungeon. We'll be able to level up and bond a little bit more. And if we battle on the way, then great. If not, that's okay too. Well, here's a battle right here. Now, only three of you? Level 10s? Come on, at least give me a challenge. You know, just regular attacks here. We don't even need to do anything special. Okay, no worries, whatever. Okay, go, go, go. Another small fight. What are you guys, level 10 as well? That's why I want to go down to the dungeon. Only real opportunity to get anything real done here. Yeah, these guys are no threat. We're getting small bits, like barely even anything, but no, no, we, we need... If we need a proper challenge to make sure we're ready for the story, because the story's already been throwing, like, level 30 guys at us. So, we need to be ready. And I think that means we're gonna need to be, like, level 40 or 50. Because here we go here. Let's go beat up these guys here. Get them out of the way. Do you have an area of effect move here? Uh, let's see. Thoughtless skewer, damage the user. Nah, no, not really. Not really. Okay, then you just do further attack on, say, this guy. Surprised he didn't bleed there. I think we should go ahead and just. Yeah, I'll hit the guy who's next here. Actually, Mega might be better. Just to get a couple more hits. Yeah, that was a little bit better. Okay, right up on Namba. I just cannot get the timing on that at all. Okay, Skitter Boy comes up and dies instantly because he was. Oh, because he's poisoned because of the poison cane that we bought earlier. Okay, no, no, I remember that now. Oh, come on, that follow-up was horrible. Okay, freestyles, we don't care about. Whatever. Drain my mana, which sucks, but... Yeah, you should be poisoned. We're gonna need a little more mana for... Um, yep, for uh, Ichiban. Okay, that's a little bit better money. Still just gonna barely get that bond up. Okay, so let's get some mana for Ichabon. I don't need health or anything. Uh, so yeah, just any mana at all. 50's gonna be a little too low. Feel like Kakabun might be right. Really good. There we go. And then just a little bit more. Maybe it's like some tea, maybe? Nobody else needs mana. That's some tea. Good. Okay, then some... I keep wanting to call it yogurt. It's not yogurt, is it? So make sure it's actually in here. The pudding! That's what it is. Give you the pudding. Really tasty. Give you the pudding. Mm, very good. That'll do. I think we're ready to go into the dungeon. Let's do it. Okay, weird place to find sneakers, but all right. Let's go. Come on, get in there. Right there. There we go. In we go. Alright, the upside here... Okay, difficulty level 4. Upside here is we're probably going to see a lot of chests and various other objects we might not be able to find otherwise. 
Okay, they're only level 20. But we're only just starting, too. Uh, so stun smash stay on this guy here. Nice. Good hits, good hits. Good old mega swing right in the middle here might work. And they all got hurt the same amount, which is nice, but that's about all that happened. Two kicks. We don't need to do anything special with Namba just yet, so we'll just do regular attack. That's fine. And then he gets to go. And missed completely. Ah, we're good. Okay. So he's basically just kind of easing us in. I appreciate that. Any items around here? I don't see anything glowing, so no, it doesn't look like it. Okay. Off we go. Thought maybe there'd be something in there, but no. Alright. Hey, guys. That's right. We have the foreman job now. Last time we were down to the dungeon, we did not have the foreman job. Which means we couldn't break in anything. But now we've actually got a shot, so to speak. I don't think he appreciated that gift. Okay, another good mega swing, like right here. I feel like we need to upgrade Kasuga's weapon. I mean, it did work. He got two of them, which is good. But I feel like we could have gotten them all down. I don't know why I think that. Okay, anything off to this side? Yeah, so see, there's that wall. Looks like we might be able to break down this time. Hopefully that's actually a thing. Let's grab the items first. Iron plate, whatever. Yep, we can totally break it down. Yep, yep, yep. So we need that foreman job all the time. Alright, so we've never been this way. I have no idea what to expect down here. Harder bad guys, maybe? I mean, it doesn't look that difficult. There's only three of them. It's a big room, though. Oh, is that a golden safe over there? That's some safes over there, for damn sure. You guys don't actually look that tough. I mean, you're level 22, which is a problem. Oh, but yeah, big ol' miss. Like I was saying, what is that? What was that? Alright, stun smash the, the strong guy here. Okay, with any luck, he's actually stunned. But let's go ahead and just... Hit him a little bit there. Okay. Uh, you know what? Birthday bash on one of the weaker guys here. Devastated by going over the hill, maybe. Okay, it's your turn. It's not going to be much. Okay, we resisted one of them. Good resist, good resist. Oh, we got one of them. It's okay, we're good, we're good. Okay, now just the Master Gambler. I think we just do... He's only level 22. Regular attack should do it. Namba hasn't really had a chance to really do anything musician-like yet. Okay, we've got decent armor, so we're okay. Apparently he's weak to slashing damage. That'll do too. Okay, let's see what these safes. Oh, that's a lot of safes. Let's see the golden safe first. Work our way down. We got tons of tons of keys. Got it. And we know where to get more. I have no idea what Omni Pouch is. I think that's for Oh, Seiko. Yeah, we don't really use the pouches anymore, so it's not good, but we can Should sell it. it. Sweet. Work close, okay, whatever. Uh, come on. Come on, open this. There we go. Should I open it? Got it. Vintage guitar. I think that's actually going to be weaker than the current guitar we have, but we can double check that just to be sure. At the very least, we can sell it. It's vintage. You gotta Should go for I something. Whoa. Oh, right. Mick. Gotta hate, gotta hate the mimics. 
Okay, this guy. We fought this guy before. He gets to go first. That hurt a little bit. Uh, fiendish slash. May leave the enemy bleeding. Go for it. Okay, he was weak to it. And he is bleeding, but didn't seem to do much there. I think get him while he's down. Bring it on. Let's uh let's burn it. Oh, he's resisting the fire. Okay, so fire is not good for him. Okay. Yeah, just I can't do anything with that. I think we're gonna need to heal generally, so give me uh endless desire. Yeah, get everyone slowly to regen here. That'll help. Yeah, he seems keep, I mean, if he has more turns, that just means he bleeds more, which I'm okay with. Uh, stun him. Let's see if we can stun him. Maybe not a bad idea. I missed it, but... No, not actually stunned. Okay. I'm just gradually get that damage up while he's down. Keep on just following up. That'd be great. Thanks. Oh, crap. He's going to explode or something? Yeah, okay. That, that hurt a little bit. Oh, shit. He KO'd two of us. Holy crap. Okay. That sucks. That means I think the regen... Oh, no. We still have the regen up. Okay, we'll try to stun him here. Costly Gunch can raise this guy up, I think. No stun. Okay, we have to use this skill. So, that's what the hero's vigor is for. Let's revive Namba. Because he's the healer. I don't think we've ever actually used this before. And that's straight up paladin nonsense. That's pretty good. He got revived with half health. That's not bad. That was the healing stop. Oh, now this McNeil again. Okay, didn't actually kill Namba. That came pretty close, though. Uh, we should heal Namba. That's what we should do. Uh, do we have a high-end heal item here? 300 HP. That should do it. Here you go, Namba. Off you go. Okay. Now, let's just go ahead and... Bring it on. He's low, but I don't think he's that low. I don't think it's going to work to hit him with the tag team. Much as I would love to. I think instead we're going to go ahead and raise... Let's raise Adachi. We're coming with half health. Let's go ahead and skip this one. So Adachi's up. Okay. Okay. Oh, no. Did it? Did that actually not raise Adachi? Why did Adachi not get raised? That's weird. Um, he's gonna resist. Okay, here we can raise raise Adachi. Why didn't that work? Let's actually just let it play out. Hey, you there? Hey, hey! I think I gotta do CPR. So talk about your breath of life, okay? I mean, that seems like poison, but sure. No CPR? I didn't need that. <laughs> that was hilarious. Okay, so that's better. Good resist, good resist. Okay, uh, slashing seems to be the way to go. Let's see if we can get that bleed up again. I didn't say anything about a bleed. Stop attacking Namba. Okay, so we're better off now. Oh, yeah? Um, I guess just Batbuster. Okay. Uh, Dachi, go ahead and go in there. I was so close. We're so close. Take him out. Take him out. Take him out. We could have healed, but I think we were better off this way. And that Necromancer's no joke. No freaking joke. Okay, we're a little hurt. Actually, Dachi's hurt most. Of course, then we have lots of healing items. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. It's a lot of sushi you just ate there. Really tasty. 
Okay, that should be good enough. All right, so dangerous area, but it all worked out. All oh, right, sorry, we want to check the guitar. Uh, let's see, Namba, you've, what about the reinforced? Uh, so we've got the vintage, which is way worse. Wow, like way, way worse. The Howling guitar is okay, but the reinforced guitar is just much, much better. <laughs> if your audience tries to rough you up. No special effect on it, unfortunately, but we'll see what we can do about that. Okay, so no other items here. Okay, so basically I think we've learned that going in here is rewarding, but also super dangerous. Um, I want to say we go this way. This looks right, because there's bad guys up here. Hey, bad guys. A lot of you. Watch me. Okay, I mean, you can go and hit anybody you like here. I think Fiendish Slash on, say, I don't know, this guy over here. Good hits, good hits. Okay, then we try to take out multiples. Give him the Mega Swing right in... I don't know, here maybe? There's no real good options. They're not very close. And we got... Hurt a couple of them, that's okay. I don't know if... I know Reckless Charge will work here. Not a whole lot of these guys in their own way. Yeah, if they were... Tied a little bit closer together, it might be able to work, but I don't know about this. This regular attacks is fine. It's say this guy. Yeah, regular attacks is just fine. We are 15 levels above these guys, so like... Really, Namba's the weakest one here, and he's doing pretty well. Okay. Uh, okay. Vile stench. Really hoping... Okay, no. Good follow-ups. Good follow-ups. One last guy. Okay, anything good in this room? Good, yeah. Definitely get ranked up there. Um, I want to say there's something over... Yeah, there we go. This thing. Come on, open it up. Open it up. There you go. Should I open it? Sweet. Okay, lots of things for Seiko-san's various other jobs, but not the current jobs she actually has. Not that she's actually with us right now. Though I guess we could always switch out the party if we really wanted to. All right, see what's in here. Ultra Walkathon. Not sure what that means. Okay, random item. What do we get? Okay, Paralytics Pultus. That'd be good for us, I guess. Uh, nothing else in here. Okay, do we just have to keep track of where we are and where we're going? So I think we go this way now. No items anywhere nearby. Really? Not even, like, tucked away over there? No? Okay. Alright, bad guys. If you guys are kind of grouped. Can you just stay that way? That'd be great. Okay, just go in there and hit somebody. Great. Okay, Mega Swing on, say, this guy should all three of them, I think. The military buffed wasn't close enough, I guess? Or he's just resistant to, uh... resistant to uh, bludgeoning. I'm good follow-ups, but he's still gonna be able to shoot his crossbow. Or use his sword, I guess. So it looks like he's also weak to sword damage. Or just any damage, really. Good, yeah, get that mutant, mutant job up. Okay, so what's in here? We've never been this way. Nothing? Oh, little tiny things. Beautiful cloth, which I guess maybe is good. And one more item over here. Big hide, okay. Honestly, don't know what I need to... to I think we need, like, I 
forget what we need in order to actually level up our weapons. There is probably one more level above where we are. Got it. Germanium bag. We keep on getting bags. Seiko's gonna like come out a bandit here. Well, I guess we can just sell it. Okay, grab this too. Demolish this. So what if it stays demolished? Like next time we go here, do we need to smash these again? Guess we'll find out. Okay, these guys might be tough. They're menacing. Watch me. Go ahead and stun smash the first guy here. I'm mean, only level 20. Didn't actually do very well there. Okay, mega swing here on say this guy. Should three of them at least. Hit four. Officer Lawless maybe, but I think we'll go for you. Okay, do we have you know the pyro might not be a bad idea. These guys are kind of lined up. It might work. Oh, I went. That was the wrong thing to do. I targeted the wrong guy. It's okay. These things happen. It's not doing that very well, though. It looks like you have better armor. Okay, you're apparently resistant to smash to a slicing. Let's see if you're okay. You're weak to electric. Though still pretty damn strong. Okay, take care of this guy. We need to focus fire here. Okay, there we go. Just one guy left. He is next though, so he does get to go unless we're really lucky here. And I just do not have good armor on Dachi. Okay, were they actually protecting anything good, or are they just happen to be in the way? So itchy. One tiny thing down here. Okay, just a paralytics poultice, which hopefully we don't need. But they've given that to us, given that to us twice now. So I'm really hoping it's just random and not indicative of what we're about to face. I could go that way, but let's go ahead and fight these guys first. Okay. Nice little stun smash on, say... I don't know who's actually the most dangerous. Let's go ahead, Guardian. There, see if I actually match the link there. Okay, just a regular attack. Maybe a bat buster on, say, this guy. They just need to be weak to electric, so that means the dodge has a good chance here. Follow up. Thank you. We gotta get Kasuga some more mana. I think that's always generally gonna be true. Let's see. Get you more mana. And you're always down like quite a bit. So here, drink this. Pretty good. That may just get you more drunk. All right, anything good over here? For our items, restorative medicine. That's actually really good. There's another one over here. There's definitely something over that way. Grab this. Sturdy iron. Okay. And. Beautiful cloth. Okay. So, what's... Let's see. We've apparently never been north. Did we just completely ignore that before? I've just never been this way. There's nothing here, though, so that would, I guess, would be why. Yeah, there's nothing here. I would expect there to be something in this corner or something, but no such luck. Alright. Uh, where are we going? Now, we... Came, did we come from this direction? Oh, there's a bunch of plants, though. Definitely pick that stuff up. Yeah, the lily seeds are good. Mysterious compost it might help. Tomato seeds. Really, we should be growing tons of stuff, I guess. Icon seeds. Garlic seeds. Potato seeds. On potato seeds, just sliced up pieces of potato. But there's no actual seed seed, right? As far as I know. Yeah, I'm a little bit lost. Let me look at the map. 
Okay, so we just need to go to the right. I can do that. I thought maybe there was gonna be a piece we could demolish to get further on, but I don't think that's true. Okay, I don't see anything else here. All right, guys, beat you up. A little bit wider of an area than I prefer. All right, so give me a give me a rapid shot on say this level 32 guy because he looks possibly dangerous. 32 is quite high. Okay, but he's pretty weak, so we're good. The other level 32 is going to be a problem too, I think. Maybe target. Uh, they're just moving around so much. Okay, you know what? I think maybe. Give me a bat buster on this guy. Because he's our level. Which worried me a little bit, but I guess we don't need to be worried at all. Okay, down to two guys, and they're pretty low, so this should be okay. So much for that. He gets to go, but. Okay, one damage. Whoop de frickin' do. Whoop de frickin' do. Come on, is the Mimic guy really gonna be our biggest problem? Okay, there's no items around here as far as I can tell. I don't see anything glowing. Off we go. The Mimic might have been our most difficult thing, or the Necromancer guy. I wanna call him a Mimic, because that's kind of the behavior he exhibits, right? Pops out of a chest that we expect to have an item. That's not a Mimic, I don't know what it is. Chinese Detoxers, I don't know why what that does. My guess would be reduces a, or eliminates a debuff, but I'm not actually sure. Hey guys. Okay, the foreman job kind of changes this about. Okay, there's a lot of titillators here, but I think the grouping might work. Oh yeah, totally worked. Totally worked. Thank you for sticking together, guys. It's interesting the girls aren't getting any experience from this at all. At least they don't appear to be. Okay, smash this. We got a bunch of seeds in here. Kind of what it looks like. Quality lumber. Not what I was expecting. I was totally expecting a seed. Alright, so what do we got over here? I wonder why the girls aren't getting any experience. They should be bonded well enough to be able to get lots of experience. I wonder if we actually need to use them in the dungeon. Maybe the experience only works with random mobs on the street, which would be unfortunate. Um, I think we're just going to do regular attacks here. These guys are too spread out. Everybody seems weak to elemental. We just need to get Namba some elemental damage. I guess he has the fire. Good solid miss. So these guys are weak to smashing, so that just works out for us. Yeah, but the girls are not getting experience. I mean, Seiko-san, at the very least, should be getting experience, because she's completely bonded with us now. So it must just be no no sharing in a dungeon. That's a strange rule. I don't agree with it. Okay, Mr. Six. Okay, we've seen this guy before. Okay, the attack bell, that's unfortunate. Uh stun smash this guy. Just see if it works. I don't think he got stunned. Alright. Um, is this guy weak to- he is weak to electric. Unfortunately, with the attack down, it's gonna be a little bit problematic here. These guys are not weak to that. You weak to fire? You are weak to fire. Alright, hit the guy who's already been hurt. Did not let him on fire, though. Cannot get the resistance there at all. He's gonna buff his friend, I think. 
Yeah, raise the evasion. That sucks. Okay, so we need to do something about this. Let's um, get a regen going. Okay, that'll at least help a little bit. They're not doing too much damage to us. I think it's fine. What skills do you have? You have Berserker Spirit. We see your attack on the next turn. Might be a bad idea. We don't know how long this attack debuff lasts. I don't think we have a good chance of putting these guys to sleep. Let's go to Berserker. You're going for broke next turn. Great. Okay, okay, so he's only got one arrow going down, but three arrows going up. That seems pretty good. Uh, let's see. Removes all status ailments by demonstrating heroic perseverance. I like it. Let's do it. It's a lot of mana, but I think it's worth it. Oh, they're unaffected, though. They, the damage down apparently didn't help us. Okay. Hyper Shout, maybe? And we can keep on... Let's go hard on... What the hell? Go to... Not you. You. Go hard on Zhang Just keep on boosting his attack. Now he's got super duper attack now. Good guard, good guard. Okay. So don't even worry about anything else. I think just go and attack this guy. Um, is he weak to... He's not weak to fire. Album drop? Yeah, album drop. I was really open for a bleed there. Okay, regular attack, big deal. Okay, so now his attack is going to really hurt. Let's do a nice little... Yeah, get him with the Karambit here. Let him bleed. He resisted the attack, unfortunately, so that wasn't great. Okay, don't even worry about... What's your compassion? Restores the HP. We don't really need that yet. And go ahead and Bat Buster this guy. And just our attack being down just sucks. I'm gonna make this last forever. Hit this guy. Come on. It's gonna make this last freaking forever. Maybe we need to take care of the big guy first. Oh, that'll least guard it. All right, let's, let's see if we can take the big guy first. Let's go higher breath on this guy. If we can set him on fire, that'd be nice. He's apparently resistant to fire, though he did take some damage. Okay, good guard, good guard. Let's go ahead and shoot the big guy. Yeah, right there, Mr. Six. He's resisting everything. Batbuster on that guy. Okay, he's weak to this. Weak to electric is good to know. Lustful energy? Ah, shit. So he's asleep. He's asleep. Okay. Resisted some of that. Okay, you're awake, thank goodness. You should heal yourself, though, because otherwise you're dead. Um, healing powder might be better for yourself there. Okay, good. Um, okay, he's used raising everybody's attack, which is bad. Just cannot freaking get anything done here. It says status ailments, which you think would affect the sleep too. Okay, the, the, the attack down is gone. So I'm gonna try Indomitable Courage and try to wake them up. I don't know what else would do it. Raise attack, boost your attack, boost your attack for two turns. Yeah, I think that's all we can do. All right, I'm gonna try to see if this wakes these guys up. Wake up, guys. Okay, there we go. There we go. Woke up. Good, 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 good. This guy's almost down. God damn fucking bitch. Okay, so... No, it's fine. It's fine. Um... 
desperate throw? We could throw this at other people. I'm not sure that's going to work too well, though. Let's just spinning throw that attacks versus a single enemy deals collateral damage to enemies along the way. I mean, I guess we hit this guy with it. Okay, he was weak to it. I'm okay with it. Let's see if we can... Yeah, see if we can blink this guy bleed. He's almost down. He's almost down. Good solid miss. Okay, we need to make sure this guy dies, so... Pyro Breath on him might kill him. Okay, well, it took out... Took him out. Took him out. We're good. So it misses. Now we don't have to worry about this too much. I mean, yes, they're still resistant to this nonsense. But we're doing okay. Get him while he's down. Uh, go ahead and stun smash this guy, which might take him out. Oh, close, but not quite. Though he is stunned. Okay, good solid misses. Hit the guy is almost down. Oh, come on, follow up. Take him out. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, taking out Mr. Six was definitely the good idea because he was buffing them. Just causing some serious consternation. Hey, look. Actual poison cane sword actually poisons. Happens so rarely. Um... Yeah, I think just regular attacks here. We're low on mana. If we could raise it, it'd be great. If we go up the stairs, we might have a good chance. Okay, whatever. It's fine. Okay, just keep on following up. I think just regular attacks from here on out. That'll do. I only got 1,400 for that? Okay, what do we actually manage to get here? Namba needs to be healed for damn sure. I'm hoping that when we go upstairs, we get a heal. Maybe even a save. Grab this. Power ring. Okay, another power ring is not a bad idea. Actually, didn't we take the power ring from Should I open Zhang Ji? I think we did. Sweet. And Digitar again. That's all we got. Okay, so if we did steal the power ring from him, I think we did too. I don't think, don't think we actually replaced it with anything. Oh, no, he has a super power ring. Which is much better than a power ring. Okay, no, we're fine. We're good. Okay, hopefully when we go upstairs, we'll find a nice heal, but that's not always true. Uh, actually, no, here it is. We did totally heal. And save too, great. All right. No using items for me. All right, now, thanks for watching. This has been Yakuza Like a Dragon. I'm PC Universe here, PC Universe 2, and I'll see you guys next time.